The Lord commands that if one believes in Christ Jesus by trusting upon Christ and him alone for salvation, that the righteousness that uh, God deserves and God requires is not in a human being who is a sinner like us, but that, that righteousness is only in Christ who is our mediator in him. The Lord says that if we trust in Christ alone for that righteousness, that will be justified. And so we only trust in the righteousness of Christ by faith and faith alone. Because this salvation that you proclaim is by grace and grace alone. And that those who put their faith in Christ and him alone for salvation are saved. And having been saved because they have seen their sinfulness, they should be baptized in obedience to God's commandment that we should be baptized when one believes. And it is also a public demonstration, which is why we are gathering like this, to see that now this brother henceforth is identifying with Christ Jesus. He is dying with Christ, is being buried with Christ, and is rising with Christ. That the Christ of the cross, the Christ of the covenants, the Christ of the gospel is glorified. And so that's why we are gathered today, so that you witness and you see that God still saves, and the gospel is powerful enough to save. And so we are going to baptize Brother Victory today on the basis of his own profession of faith, that he has believed in Christ and him alone, and trash, trusting the righteousness of Christ and that alone. And so, now, Brother Victory, on the basis of your own profession of faith, that you believe in Christ, you are trusting in Christ and him alone for salvation, and that he is the source of righteousness upon which you will stand before God, the holy God of the Bible. We now baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit.